Hey, this is Nicholas Seward, and I have to give you a preview of this harmonic drive I built. I should wait because it's missing some stuff, but I'm just so excited I have to show somebody. So, um, this drive has a 231 gear rate to 1 gear ratio. It's pretty insane, and I don't really think I'll actually use something that insane whenever... Um, whenever I actually build uh, build this into a machine. It's just, um, these are the parts I had on hand, and so that's what it ended up being. Um, I'll sh this belt comes into a quite large um, pulley down here, and that can be shrunk quite a bit, and this um, stepper can be moved over um, quite a bit, and the sh stepper can be shrunk and um, to like maybe only a 25 millimeter high stepper and get it way in here. Um, and get this thing really compact. <clears throat> and um, let's see, let me get this moving so you can see it in action. Oh, there, there we go. So here you can see what's going on on the inside. Um, if you look real close, you can see a 3D printed belt in there. And uh, that's going to get replaced with an actual um, HTD uh, three millimeter pitch uh, belt. When I get it in, actually, um, I already changed the design, and so the belt I'm going to get in is going to be the wrong size, so I have to order another belt. And uh, check out that hollow shaft, so you can run your your uh, wires right through that. So that's pretty sweet. Um, one thing I am missing is. Um, this uh, this um, piece right here um, it should actually be a bearing and uh, it's a 70 millimeter by eight, eight, uh, 90 millimeter by 10 millimeter bearing um, an 8 uh, 68 14 bearing and um, I found those from China for seven bucks and that's the most expensive component of this whole thing everything else can be had for pretty dang cheap it's pretty smooth considering um, that I still have a, I have a printed belt in there and I have a um, plastic just friction bearing. It's just it's just a bushing right now. <clears throat> so the plan is that I can um, there's some mount holes up here so you can like have an arm that cups over that. And so that's how you're going to do the arm on the other side, on one side. And this side, um, where the, the uh, stepper is attached to, that will be the arm. So that'll get extended out and, um, and that'll get mounted on down there. All the harmonic goodness stuff, all the interesting components are all in the middle here and those parts. So that'll be the unit. I, I can just print a whole bunch of these out and then you just have to print out. You're, you have to make your mating surfaces of your arms just right so either it can go on the bottom here or it can cup into the top here. And so everything should be pretty modular. Anyways, I'm just so excited. I thought you, could just, thought you guys would like seeing that. Um, I don't know what kind of backlash I'll get. Um, this is just a preview, so I'll have to wait to get hard data and whenever I get that bearing and, and, and get the belt in. So anyways, hope you guys enjoyed.